A great recipe has a real poetry to it. It's thoughtfully written, it's elegant, it conveys even the most complicated techniques in a simple way so that the home cook never gets flustered and can seamlessly follow a recipe from start to finish. My love of food and cooking comes from my mom. She's always been an amazing cook. Even the most prosaic meals would be peppered with spices and Indian flavors. I remember as a child, I would take a pile of cookbooks and curl up in bed and spend hours combing through them. My career in food and food publishing was really ignited about 15 years ago. I'd actually just finished a master's degree in international relations of all things. But then I stepped back and thought to myself whether that was what I really wanted to do and realized it wasn't. Instead, I enrolled in culinary school to do a professional diploma in food and wine. I moved to New York 10 years ago and since then I've been writing for a whole variety of different food magazines and online publications. I've written for Slate and Saveur and Epicurious, I had a column for Forbes, I was a contributing editor at Fine Cooking Magazine. I've also written three cookbooks. The most recent one was about the top women chefs in New York and I've spent years really understanding what makes a great recipe and all this has been integral to the building of the cookbook site. One of the things that we've included in the platform is the ability to personalize your search results. I have a new baby at home and it seems that my, my baby might have a, a milk allergy so I can't have dairy anymore. And I found that the site has been a great resource for me because we have some fantastic vegan cookbooks. You know, one of the books is Thug Kitchen. You know, one of the recipes that I really love from Thug Kitchen is this coconut cornmeal cake. And this is a recipe that I would never have discovered had we not had the ability to search by dietary preference. And we made a real effort to ensure that we covered as many different cuisines from all over the world. One of my favorite authors is Machala Hassan, who is really the doyen of Italian cooking. And another food writer that I absolutely adore is Paula Wolford, who specializes in Mediterranean cuisine. And she writes with real authority and she's really immersed herself in these cuisines. And I'm Malaysian and love cooking Southeast Asian food. And so I'm really excited that we have a number of titles by Sri Owen. And she approaches her writing and her cooking with a really sort of scholarly um, precision. Now is the time for cookbook because we really enable home cooks to reach that next level of success with their cooking.